Hi, and welcome to Quirky Books with Katie. Today I'm going to be doing my December favorites video. So, in these types of videos, I talk about just some of my favorite things in the month of December, not necessarily book related. However, my first favorite is a book favorite, and my favorite book that I read this month is Rose Under Fire by Elizabeth Wine. This is the companion novel to Codename Verity. Although I did not read Codename Verity, I still read this one and I don't think you have to read it to enjoy this book. But this book is about a fighter pilot named Rose Justice and it takes place during World War II. And Rose is captured by the Nazis while she is flying her plane and she is stuck in the concentration camp of Ravensbrook and it really tells her story and this is just such a moving amazing book that I think everyone needs to read. I really enjoy reading about the Holocaust and historical fiction and this is definitely one of the best I've ever read. Next I have a few makeup favorites and my first makeup favorite is this Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. And this bronzer is amazing. I usually never purchase high-end products but I actually got this in like a Christmas gift set and it's just a travel size and I never really thought I'd use bronzer either but it just looks so good. It's just this like a light brown color and it does smell like chocolate honestly that's one of my favorite things about it and I just use this to contour on the my cheeks and I've been getting a lot of more compliments on my skin lately so I think it's working and I really enjoy it I used to contour with is the Real Techniques buffing brush and I love these brushes because I do get most of my brushes from the drugstore but some of them are kind of crappy and they sell these at Kohl's which is where I got it and I believe they're usually about like five to ten dollars which is pricey but it's a really good brush that I feel like you could get a lot of use out of. My next favorite is this on the spot acne treatment by Neutrogena and I don't really get a lot of bad breakouts but when I do I put this on and they clear up within a few days and I feel like it's just a really useful thing to have in case you get like a random zit or something and you need to get rid of it fast. And my last beauty favorite is the Vanilla Bean Noel Body Lotion from Bath & Body Works. As you guys probably know, I have a severe obsession with Bath & Body Works. If you guys ever want me to like show you all of the Bath & Body Works stuff I have, let me know because that would be a fun video to do. Although you guys would all think I'm an addict. But this is my favorite scent by them. And I say that all the time, but this is actually my favorite scent by them. The description is a merry blend of snow white vanilla, warm caramel, and whipped cream sprinkled with holiday sugar cookies and kissed with soft musk. Just smells like vanilla and cookies and Christmas and I just freaking adore this scent. If you guys have not smelled it yet, you need to. And now I'm getting to my favorite part of the video where I tell you guys some of my music favorites for the month. And I will have all of these linked in the description box below if you want to check any of them out. So my first favorite has been the song Say Something by A Great Big World and Christina Aguilera. I don't really listen to a lot of like popular music, but for some reason I really like this song. I just think it has a lot of emotion in it and it's a really sad song. I listen to a lot of sad music. I don't know why, but I just really like that song and it's one of the only songs on the radio I actually like. Uh, my next favorite is Let It Go by Adina Menzel. I saw Frozen last month and I really liked it and I've been listening to the entire soundtrack basically on repeat but that is my favorite song. Literally if someone will plays it I will start bursting out into song which I'm a terrible singer so that offends a lot of people but I just love that song and I love Frozen. Who doesn't? My next song favorite is Bowery by The Local Natives. My friend actually told me to check out this song. And The Local Natives are another new band that I discovered this month that I really like. They are just your typical indie band and I really like their music. It's just really happy and upbeat in contrast to all the other music that I usually listen to. My next favorite is Waiting Game by Banks. I actually discovered this song on the show The Originals, which is the spinoff from The Vampire Diaries. And the, both The Originals and The Vampire Diaries use amazing music. And I just like this song. It's really like creepy and haunting and sad, which are my favorite things in music. And my last favorite this, for this month is the song The Draw by Bastille. I, 
I just love Bastille. They're probably my favorite band. And this song isn't on their album Bad Blood, but it is going to be on their upcoming album All This Bad Blood. I think they released it a while ago, but only in England. And I found it on YouTube. And it's just... It's just an amazing song and I listen to it all the time and if I have my iPod in I am probably listening to the song. You guys should definitely go check it out. So let me know in the comments down below what your favorites have been during the month of December. So thank you guys for watching. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and I will talk to you again soon.